Hey everyone, um, I was actually very lucky to get this shoe. This is the 2013 black and gold Jordan 1s. It only came out in New York, so you know how rare these are. And in every store that I came out in it, they only had about 20 pairs. So this, this one size 8 was extremely hard to get. And also online on Nike RSVP system, they only let you uh, RSVP from 9 to 13, I believe. So this size 8 was even harder to get. And um, the reason why Jordan only released these uh, in New York was because on that day they had a, a, a game for like high school students in the Barclays Center and they had like three games so this was kind of like a tribute to them um, they actually played like and they had the same colors uh, at the game it was a black and gold there was a rumor that they were selling these shoes at the Barclays Center but that wasn't true so let's talk about the box first um, it's the regular retro 1985 box. So you can see it right here. It's a 1985. Plain white tissue. Oh, shoe wrapping paper. Nothing inside this box. Little Nike check on the lid with the serial number. And then the authenticity sticker right here in the back. So the whole shoe is patent leather. It's all black. It's very shiny. Right here is actually gold trim, extra laces. It doesn't say Nike Air on it like the SB um, packs. It's just rolled up. Clear, um, glittery bottom. A lot of noise outside, sorry guys. And then actually inside there's no Jumpman logo, it's actually a Nike Air logo. You see it well. That's very rare. <laughs> It says Nike Air on the tongue. And the shoe size inside the shoe is actually not on the uh, on the sides of the shoe. It's actually on the tongue of the shoe. Oh shit. See right there. Even the wing logo here for Air Jordan, that's patent leather too. It's like shiny color. And then this gold stitching on the midsole. Um, because of the rarity of the shoe, the price of it is really high. But if this was like, because I could see this like women's sizes. And definitely if they mass produce this, this wouldn't be as hyped up of a shoe. But because this it's so limited, it's super hard and super rare to get. I can't fit a size 8, so I can't really tell you the comfort of the shoes. But it's very insulated. It has a lot of cushion on in the um, insoles. So I'm pretty sure this is going to be a good shoe to wear. But patent leather creases very, very easily. So the toe box right here will probably be creased unless you put like a force, force shield inside. 